Hello and welcome to another video from me. Uh, today's video is going to be a short one. I'm just going to show you some of the paintings I've done recently and maybe tell you a little bit about them. And I'm sorry the light is very bright but I, uh, I'm in my shop so to speak so the lighting isn't the best in here. I need to fix that <laughs> eventually. So, yeah, let's start with this one that I made uh, some weeks ago. It's a little rowing boat and this is one of the lakes on the island. You can uh, hopefully see it. Uh, so yeah, this is one of them. And here we have another. In where I kind of play a lot around with colors a lot as you can see so it's an ocean with a sailboat here and you see the islands in the background and there's a very vivid sky yeah I wanted to to just play around with colors and make it as colorful as possible I have like this thing that I I like to exaggerate how things really look because uh, my paintings will never look as a photo because if you want a photo I think you can just go out and snap one yourself. So here we have a deer in the forest also very vividly painted with colors, uh, vivid colors. Uh, I'm just going to show you some of what I've done. And here we also have a boat in a stormy sea. And I painted this with a paint knife. So I didn't use any, any uh, real brushes for this one. I just used a lot of paint and a paintbrush. Uh, I'm going to show you some more. I'm just going to put them back. Here we have a picture or a painting of one of the ferries that goes out to the island from the mainland. And this is at Strömkajen where it's uh, we're in Stockholm where it uh, launches from out into the archipelago. And you can see the city in the background and this boat is called Roslagen. I don't really know if it's in use today. Uh, actually, I, I haven't really thought about it. <laughs> but I also make uh, less natural or less... Uh, yeah, less uh, realistic paintings. Like this is a little fairy. And she's holding actually, a, I think this is a forest nymph. And she's actually holding a fairy in her hand. So I, I just don't paint realistic or depictions of the archipelago. I, I try to mix it up with like <laughs> a little bit of fantasy and things like that. Here we have for example Red Riding Hood. And you can see the wolf in the background on the full moon. And these are painted on a canvas which is on a wooden frame. And uh, yeah, so it's not just paintings of the archipelago, even though that's basically what I do most. Like here we have a lighthouse. Paul Cobb's fear, a motif that I have done several times by now, I guess. People tend to like these lighthouses. Also made on a canvas that's uh, on a wooden frame. Makes them kind of easier to hang because you can put a nail in the back and just hang them on it. You don't have to have a frame or anything. Uh, another Ocean painting, which is this one, is made of on a Duke Panoa, which is uh, 
canvas glued to a paper, a stiff paper. Uh, and uh, this one I made recently, I call this broken. You can uh, take away from that what you like, but it's a head with cogs that are cracked. And I actually made this by painting the outlines of the skull first, or I painted the background first. Then I painted the skull and I taped around it and put various cogs that I had and took a black spray bottle, spray paint and sprayed. So yeah, I hope you like it. Uh, what else do we have that's pretty... Well, I also make kind of comedic ones. This is called the, the eel strangler. <laughs> In the lack of better titles. <laughs> so yeah, I make things like that too. Mm, even though that's not what I base mostly do. And uh, I try to play around with paint a lot. Like when I did this one, this is a guy rowing on a very windy sea. I hope you can see it. That's the problem even when I put out my paintings for sale. That uh, a picture can't really, can't really show you the real thing. Because it looks better in real life. But uh, as you can see I painted this using a paint knife too. I don't know the English word for paint knife, but it's kind of like a knife, well. <laughs> so yeah, that's some of the paintings I've done recently. Uh, I was going to film a little documentary about the ghost oak on the island, a little spooky something for you. But I couldn't find someone to hold the camera today, so that will have to wait. So instead I made this little, well, art video, I guess, if you want to call it that. I'm going to finish this by just picking up the camera and film some of the paintings that are hanging on the walls. And if you, <coughs> sorry, if you like my content, if you want to know more about me, yeah, the archipelago, feel free to subscribe to this channel by pressing the subscribe button down here somewhere. And you can also press the little bell icon. That way you will be notified whenever I get whenever I get a new video published. With that said, I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I will see you in the next video and goodbye.